What's happening, Forum? Forum, don't you hate it when you're driving along, minding your own business, and a fucking horse jumps out in front of your car? Happen to be a couple of horses that hopefully nobody. Oh God! Oh damn, that was awful. Let's see it again. Bam! Geez, I hope Seabiscuit had insurance. It makes me laugh when I imagine the guy telling his side of the story to the police. I swear to you, officer, the horse merged into me. I had my blinker on, I gave the hand signal. One thing's for sure though, whatever hit his car had a hell of a lot of horsepower. Get it? Horsepower? Cause they're horse- God damn it, never mind. Forum, I have got to show you the best fight scene in the history of martial arts movies. Now this is from a 1993 movie called Undefeatable. And it's just so amazing, I can't even describe it. Just check it out. better. Suddenly this chick comes out of nowhere and starts whooping some ass. <laughs> Did that Rob Schneider looking guy just get his ass kicked with a bath towel? And the ending is just the best ever. <laughs> John Woo would be jealous. They just don't make them like they used to. All right, one last thing before I go and finish unpacking. So there's this infomercial on TV for something called a smart mop. And the infomercial is pretty standard. The guy demonstrates the utility of the mop by pouring a Diet Coke on the floor. What do you do if you get a spill like this all over your kitchen floor? This is a whole can of soda. I'll tell you, you reach for the smart mop, wind it, drop it down, and you're ready to go. But I want you to listen to what he says afterward. In these tough times, bring it back into the glass, and it's ready to drink all over. What? It's ready to drink all over? Like, hey, I know you just mopped up the dried piss underneath the urinal, but... Times are tough. Okay, I mean, maybe they were joking, but they should let people know that they were joking. Like, yo, can I get an LOL, a LaMau, a Raffle Mathau, something? <laughs> you know what time it is for them. It's time for the comment question of the day, which comes from a user named Lion Mashi, and she said, If you are capable of being an animal, any animal you want for a day, which animal would it be and why? Please choose me, Ray. Thank you very much. Bye. So if you could be any animal, which would you be and why? Leave your interesting or creative responses in the comment section below. And don't forget to submit your video for the next episode's comment question of the day. But thanks for watching today's episode of Equals 3. I'm Ray William Johnson, and I approve this message. And hopefully by the next episode, I'll have a nice background set up for you guys so I don't look like a hobo living out of boxes. Anyway, so tell me, Forum, if you knew you were going to die tomorrow, what would be the last thing you'd do? You know we straight with you and your mom. Yeah, see ya.